Beat. Hello, people of the world. International greeting time. Hola, aloha, ciao, salut, ni hao, namaste, ohayo, yagamasima. Zdrasuche. Previs, buna, jindubri, siestok. Hello, sincha, yabosio. Tere, salam aleko, or, sa, or you can say salam aleko, or salam aleko, uh, saskriakau, marhaban, merhaba. Welcome everyone who doesn't know who I am. My name is, uh, who I am. <laughs> Welcome everyone who doesn't know who I am. My name is Brunel. Okay, so you know, you've seen the title. I actually only bought one of the lip kits. Thank you very much, or should I say lip sets. Um, this one. Um, listen, they don't send to me for free. I buy them and they're £33 each. And, and unless I'm going to be wearing the shades, I'm not buying. Okay, so actually these sets, um, there is one which was super, super light. It had lots of mauve type colours. Hopefully you'll be able to pick up that here on camera. I'm not sure. Let's see. Focus, focus camera, focus on my face. But anyway, so it's got lots of like mauves and pinks, but they're so bright and, and it was just like, um, no, no. If I'd used those colours, I would have looked as if I'd caught myself an STD. Never a good look. Don't think so. Um, so I decided no. So in that bright shade, they had Medusa, Flirt, Enchanting and Snobby. No, thank you. And then they had uh, the next one as well, which you, I would have been able to wear two of uh, the colours. And I, it would have been the actual lipsticks themselves that, rather than the uh, strobe lipsticks. And that was had a um, Spice Girl, Trophy what, trophy Wife, Ritzy and Snobby. So the uh, strobes that were just uh, kind of like one was too bright, of, like, literally like a gold. Uh, and it would have made me look very, very sick. And then they had another pink one, which was just too much. So that again was a no. So the one that I went for was the one with the deeper shades, of course, the deeper skin tone. Uh, so in that, you've got Heartbreaker and also Material Girl. That's me as well. And also Fearless. Yeah. And also Shameless. Yes. So I decided to go for that. £33 each. I bought mine from uh, Cult Beauty and within the lip set you've got a two mil of uh, well it says what two lots which are two mil and then you've got the strobe which I believe is 1.9 mil so just for life um and yeah so in the set like so voila you open it up like this you've got it this is the back it gives shows you the color shades here um and you've got uh, these are the matte shades at the top the matte lipsticks and you've got here heartbreaker which is like the red and then you've got the purple which is a uh, um a material girl and of course below you've got the uh, lip toppers which are the strobes at the bottom and this one here is shameless and the other one is fearless um so you've got that and then you open it up like so um and you've got it's like almost like a little treasure trove so you've got the plastic that comes off and then you have them here so you have here in here you have the two lipsticks and then you've got the two strobes here so without further ado let's start off i'm not too sure which one i'm gonna go for which one's gonna most likely kind of discolor my lips more than the other i'm trying to get them out <laughs> they're out now all of them just takes too long trying to fuss around doesn't it yeah well actually all of them are not out this one here the one that i want them okay don't, don't you just like this? Isn't it well planned? I always, always struggle with uh, packaging. I am terrible. Anyway, so let's apply the purple first. Uh, lip, uh, the purple lipstick, which is Material Girl. And we'll go for it and see just... Uh, because I haven't actually got... I don't own any Huda um lipstick so i don't know what the formula is like so this is the first for me as well i'm not going to use lip liner because to be honest i'm wearing something completely different and i need to go out and i'm not going to be wearing these particular lipsticks because i don't go with what i wear example there you have it jumpsuit so uh, these colors are not going to go so let's just try it out i've been talking for four minutes <laughs> too long 
Right, let's try it out. Ooh, pigmented. <gasps> There's a smell. Not particularly pleasant. It is, ooh. Nice formula, so pigmented, very opaque. And I still haven't dipped back in. No lip liner. This is actually a really good formula. Really, really nice. So this is Material Girl without any gloss on it. And I have to say, I love this formula. It is so opaque. And with regards to how I managed to smooth out, I basically went back in, got the formula out, applied it at the top of my lip, and then what was left on the, on the actual applicator, I just went over the inner bit of my lip and that's all I did. So, I mean, it's just, I am I am so happy with this formula. It does dry your lips though. I can actually feel it drying, kind of like drying on the lips. So be mindful of that. Um, but mm, I love the formula. However, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm feeling a little bit tingly on my lip, actually, right in this area. That's feeling, like, oh, no, nah, I'm hoping that I'm not having the same reaction someone send me a text message i'm hoping it's not the same reaction that i have with uh, mac lip glosses so just going to apply the strobe on top which is fearless and we'll see Ooh, i'm actually just gonna keep it in the middle and see what that's like so this is heartbreaker um out on its own without the gloss and by the way i've uh, used a lip liner which is um nyx cola it's like a brown the color range that i got were the darkest ones and to be honest this one needed a bit more help. The other one, you know, as I stated, nice and easy, really, really opaque. This one, I needed to go over it again, second time around with a, with a second coat in order to dry, uh, you know, to, to get it to, to the level that I was happy with. And now we're just going to apply the stroke because it's slightly dry. Even with the second coat, I can see it takes a bit longer to dry here. I'm still not happy, it's not opaque enough for me so for me the best shade is just material girl that seems to work but this one is a mm, no so i'm kind of glad that i didn't get the other the other you know um kits as well the other sets so we're just going to apply that and what i'm applying now is shameless and there we have it Ooh, very pretty very very pretty Oh yeah. Oh, that is a beauty. Oh, this will be fantastic on its own. Just on its own. It is so, uh, this is my favorite actually. Oh, I'm not normally disturbing stuff, but this, mm, oh yeah. And what I do like about it is if you want to keep it low and you don't want a high shine, you can do that. Um, or if you want to go really high gloss, then you can do that too. Okay, so this is it with the full gloss on. Now I decided to go all over. It's a bit of a mess and I just can't be bothered um, to mess about with it because they're not the easiest things to take off and I need to go out and it doesn't match what I'm wearing. So it's a bit of a, yeah. Okay, so overall, how do I feel about it? I don't know, actually. I'm not 100% convinced. I just feel as if... Um, You've got the formula and when you get the right color shade, it is beautiful. It kind of is really opaque, but you're going to have that tingly feeling and then you're going to feel that your lips tightening as uh, the formula dries, which feels uncomfortable. 
Um, the actual strobes themselves are actually quite nice, actually. I would wear them separate on their own with, uh, uh, you know, some make sure that I put a, um, a lip pencil on and they would work really well. So I actually really, really like the strobe. Uh, my favorite is definitely this one, which is shameless. It is so nice, so lovely. It's got the aspects of gold and so on in there as well, and so a peach and so on. So I really, really like this one. It's my favorite at the whole kit. Uh, and then the combination of uh, this one here, fearless and also um, material um, material girl work much much better um, the formula itself takes about two or so minutes for it to dry if you do get the wrong get the wrong shade you might have to top up a good three times at least to get be able to get a little right level of opacity if opacity I don't know even if that's a word but you know for it to be nice and smooth and and not streaky on your lips so it has got its issues but as a kit together actually at 33 pound it is worth the money when you see that you've got four items in there so that's not bad itself considering one of the lippies can cost you around uh, i think it's 16 or 18 pounds or something like that so when you take that into account it is a value for money you just have to be lucky enough to make sure that you choose the shades which are right for you otherwise then you're not really saving anything to be honest um and yeah but so i've got my um, i don't know Make up your mind, to be honest, as whether you want to go ahead or not. Um, but some I'm happy with, some are, eh, I'm sort of okay. I'm not necessarily I'm happy, but I'm sort of okay with. Now, I'm, I don't know if I'm going to go out wearing this with what I'm wearing. But hey, thank you as usual for watching. I'm sorry it's not conclusive, um, but sometimes that's the way it works. And I do appreciate you taking the time to watch my video as usual. Now I'm going to take me, my nice big wig, and my boobies, and everything out and about. Because it is nearly 2 o'clock in the afternoon. I was meant to be out at 11. <laughs> Bye.